The long awaited opening of the International African American Museum is finally here. The museum leaders, along with folks at Morris AME Church, held a worship service last night to open the weekend of events. And Summer Hector was there and shares with us the excitement around the museum and the sermon last night. The main message of the sermon last night at Morris AME Church downtown Charleston was celebrating the opening of the museum, but also a reminder to people to let this museum tell stories of African American culture, the good and the bad. Don't let the museum be a one time visit. A museum is a living institution. We have not even procured all the things people got in their houses and their barns. But come see what our people went through. Another speaker last night was Bishop Samuel Green. He says this museum represents strength coming out of strange and hard places in history. A museum nearly 20 years in the making. It will show the culture and history of African Americans from Africa up until now, present time. Reverend Howard John Wesley preached the sermon. He came from Virginia. His message mostly about keeping history alive. That was the message from really all of the speakers last night. The purpose of having this museum in Charleston, they say, is being storytellers. With that said, thank you very much. Now, the International African American Museum officially opens to the public next Tuesday, but on Saturday, there is a community dedication watch party. That one happening at 10 a.m. at Marion Square in downtown Charleston. Sure to be a fun and exciting weekend with all activities preparing for the official opening of the museum. In Charleston, I'm Summer Hector, Live 5 News.